nigga. Two chains on my niggas camp. I don't fight nigga with no camp. I'm the leader, nigga in slam. Shake your ass, the plan. Two chains on my niggas camp. I don't fight nigga with no camp. I'm the leader, nigga in slam. Shake your ass, the plan. Prepare nigga, we shoot our clan. 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 What's up YouTube, I'm back again with another video and in this video I'll be showing you how to use autotune on NCH software by Mixpad version 9.79 NCH software, welcome back to NCH software academy So um, today I decided like, how to, sh to show you how to get your pitch correction, your pitch corrector uh, the right way A lot of people like I've been seeing a lot of videos on YouTube where people say like you need to choose any key any key you prefer then you'll just get it then uh, your vocal will sound good it depends on your voice blah 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 so today I want to show you the right way how to do it so um, as I already mentioned we are using Mixpad Vision 9.79 by NCH Software so um, shout out to JP um, for the beat I got this beat on YouTube is made by JP so the first thing you need to do the moment like you get in it into your door um, and uh, on your door on mix pad is to change the the tempo so the tempo of the page is 61.5 so here we have to write like 60 uh, 1.5 uh, 61.5 so should use come what's happening okay so 61 plus 61 is 18 what it won't allow me to say 0.5 then Okay, that's correct. Then the time signature is four. Um, the uh, and the scale of the beat. The beat is made on B minor. So um, I did mention this a um, few time on the comment section that if you want to know like your uh, the key of the beats, like um, one thing that I would advise you guys, you need to do get your beat. After getting your beat, get to know you need to know or like. Um, the scale of your beat or which scale your beat was made on for example some beats are made on a major some are made on b major some are made on uh, c minor scale um, all those keys some are made on um, maybe on f sharp minor f sharp minor so there are so many different keys so in order to get your auditune correct on your vocals you need to understand the key on which the beat was made on so here we have b so the beat this beat was made on b minor uh the the tempo of the beat is 61.5 now the beat is made by jp beats shout out to the shout out to the brother so uh we go to fx we go to add we go to uh, vst you just select any um just select any audio tune you prefer or pitch corrector you, pre you prefer but for this case I'll be using G snap auto tune so go back uh, so it's B minor so I have to use B minor on this one so select scale from here after clicking that select scale go to this A then you click on B then you go here we go on minor because so here we have minor python uh pythonic so it is the one which we will be using click ok so you're done with your first um step of setting your autotune correctly you need to understand uh what key your beat was made on after understanding what key your beat was made on you said that you, you take that key your beat was made on and you put it on your autotune on any beat and the only way to understand where your key was made on there are so many online um, website which will show you what key your beat was made on all you have to do just upload your beat 
on that website they need to analyze you it would analyze the bid for you then it will let you know which key your bid was made on you can search like um uh online uh bid key finder or a bid key finder anything online or you can also use what's so called auto tune by uh you can also use what's so called auto key but you can also use visual dj for those who have visual dj visual dj automatically tells tells you like the key um of whatever track you you, you decided to insert on your desk or whatever so sometimes like the producers do give you like um the key the key of the beat for example jp beats does give you the key of the beat if you go to jp beats on on, on his channel you see on, when you go straight to the description you'll see like he will give you the key of the beat he will give you like the the temp or the ppm of the beat the temp and the ppm is one of, is, is, is the same thing so that when you the moment you get into your door you just put your temp the right way then when you are when you are using auto tune just set the key the producer gave you so um if you still don't understand please leave the comment so that i can try to emphasize more so um i decided to set my key after setting my key what else do i do so i have all those different uh things so the speed the speed is straightforward is how much like you want your auto tune uh, to reach the vocal how fast you want your auto tune to reach the vocals so the higher you, you put the speed that means it will be very fast um so if you want it to be natural you don't need like a very high speed if you want your vocal to be natural so what i usually do like to hear to do here like most of you guys who watch my tutorials you, you will see that and um, what i do here just try it to 100 percent because i want the attitude to be very strong this attitude is not like the very strong uh this pitch corrector is not that strong so like pushing that button to 100 percent is very good um on my personally uh on my side so another thing that i like to do here just click around uh 10 for depends uh, on the vocal but for now i'll just click for pitch band and uh, let's put pitch band around 20 then uh i will play the vocal To change some of the latest camp, I don't fight you with no camp. I'm the leader in this land. Check your ass the plan. To change some of the latest camp, I don't fight you with no camp. I'm the leader in this land. Check your ass the plan. Prepare no shoe now clan. 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 So um the first thing you'll you'll notice they say like no man there's no audio tune here like they there is audio tune it's just like um uh I feel like I'm rapping here but if like you let's say like you can sing like for real you can sing and you do the same exit step you'll you'll feel audio tune so what I usually like to do when like this um a little audio tune I like to to double use uh, I like to double use my uh, my auto tune I like to use my auto tune twice so what I usually like to do when people like uh, say like okay there's little or no auto tune like I'll just double use my auto tune so I'll just re put my auto tune again and then for the for the second audio tune I'll try to make it uh, as a hash as much as I want it to be Put it there. Uh, be my mm. I just make it hash. Uh, it, ju it just depends on on, uh, on what you want to achieve, you know. <laughs> to change some of niggas' camp, I don't fight me with no camp. I'm the leader, nigga, in slam. Shake your ass the plan to change some of niggas' camp. I don't fight me with no camp. I'm the leader, nigga, in slam. Shake your ass the plan. Prepare no shoot no clan. Yeah, hey guys. Um, I think that's all. So um, I'll just put like a little bit of a review so you can see like um. Uh, if you decided like to work around your audio cue and, and if you can sing or um next week i'll try to do uh, another tutorial whereby i will be singing just to show you guys how to
Oh, another thing, guys, you need to understand. So, if you want your audio tune to be um, to hear your audio tune the right way, is to put what's so called reverb, but um, to put what's so called reverb. But this tutorial is not on reverb. I'll do it next time. So, putting a reverb is very, very uh, one of the most um, what do for the reverb? Okay, in turn based. It. So, putting a, a reverb can play a huge um, role to make your audio tune sound good. But on this tutorial. We're not focusing on the reverb, we're only focusing on audio tune. So, uh, try to do whatever, try, just try to do what I showed you and let me know, like, does it make any difference on your vocal, on your vocals? And um, I'll, I'll be waiting for your comments so that I can see um, what, uh, what, which sort of I can do uh, next time. So, like, just to keep things a little bit uh, straightforward for the last time, you need to understand the key which your beat was made on uh, the only way to find your key the only way to find your key on what key your beat was made on is to go online and find like the um, the beat the key beat finder online or you can use a uh, visual dj um, you can also use auto key there are so many different software you can use to make sure like you understand sometimes the producers do give you the key on which they made the beat on you know so yeah, you need to understand the key the beat was made on. So you take that key that the beat was made on and you put it on your auto tune. Official, you put the auto tune on your vocals. Then, um, then that's all. Then that's all. That's when you start mastering your vocals. Blah blah blah. So um, going straight to the to the to the buttons. Uh, this is the amount how I want my auto tune to be hundred percent. This is a threshold. If you say put drag it down, that means it will be uh, threshold is like uh how many uh you, you want your auto tune on which space you want your auto tune above uh five cents you know something like that so okay uh, let me play it for the last time <laughs> to change some my neighbors camp and i don't fight me we not can't fight me we not camp and the leader nigga is the leader nigga is lame shake your ass the plan to change some my neighbors camp and i don't fight me so it is very important to understand to get to understand this point so i think that's all guys for this video i will see you next time